Hi and welcome back. Again, this is Ben from Nendry, and in this video we'll set up the Bitfinex account. So first of all, um, just click the link below or in the form you'll see it to head over to Bitfinex and um, sign up your account there. And once you've activated your account by email, you'll be logged in and most likely you'll be asked to set up two-factor authentication, which is I think by now um, uh, mandatory. So most likely you'll actually end up here on the security page and then be asked to set up two-factor authentication. Now, this is basically the same as we did with Bitstamp. So you can use the same app, Google Authenticator for that. Simply click set up Google Authenticator. And then again, a QR code will, do, will be displayed with a recovery code. And I again recommend to take a screenshot of that uh, so that you have it back up in case you lose access to your phone. Once you've done that, you're almost done on Bitfinex actually. Next thing that we need to do is again to create API keys so that Landry can take care of the entire automation process and funding process for you. So in the left navigation, let's select API and then you can say create new key. This is where we want to go. And again, we only need to assign certain um, permissions so that Landry can do all the work for you. First of all, um, we don't need to change anything here. We'll need um, the permission to create and cancel orders. So this is the second switch here. This is necessary in order to um, convert the ripple that will be sent via Bitstamp back to US dollars and then um, have those US dollars available for the lending process. Now, margin trading, we don't, we don't need to worry about that. In the margin funding section, we again need the permission to offer, cancel and close funding. This is the actual lending automation and optimization that Lendry will do for you. So let's put this permission on here. And then the last thing that we need is the permission to transfer between wallets. Um, so this is important because ultimately the Ripple will arrive on what is called the exchange wallet. So that's the spot market where you can exchange all kinds of cryptocurrencies for each other. And this is also where we um, or the Lendry software will exchange the Ripple for US dollars. And then in order to be able to lend these US dollars, we actually have to transfer these US dollars from the exchange wallet to the funding wallet. And if you assign this permission, then we can also automatically do that for you. And that is all you need to do. Next up, we just need to assign a name. So for example, call that Landry and generate new API key. Well, next up, you'll be asked to enter the two-factor two authentication token. Let me quickly do that. Um, here we go. And then again, we have to confirm the API key creation via email. So let me quickly do that as well. Um, create API key, it says. Here we go. Um, once you click the link in the email, you'll be taken to this page. Make sure you're still logged in. That's important. That's how Bitfinex authenticates that uh, everything is correct. And then again, we need these two keys in order to have the Landry automation um, working for you. Just put them into the form below and then you're all good to go. All right. Uh, with that, happy lending. Uh, if there's any question, feel free to reach out, out to us anytime and uh, we'll, we'll respond as soon as we can and help you set up everything. All the best, bye.